All right, John, you came into this match expecting it to be a physical one. Did the match play out like you expected? It did a bit. Uh, you know, it was, it was one of those games that were very direct from both teams. Uh, both teams put each other under immediate pressure. And we started slow. I had to change the structure at half-time. That was, uh, you know, they had their diamond in midfield and with the shape we'd set up with, we just didn't really cope with it. So the change at half-time changed everything, really, and we were able to get a goal quite quickly. And I don't think we looked back. We never really looked under pressure in the, in the second half. A few little half chances from Italy, but, you know, we've hit the crossbar. Uh, a couple of good opportunities that, that should have went away and Christine had another good scoring opportunity so all in all I think it was it was a solid performance from the group and it was a resilient one and, and another solid second half which we seem to keep doing. Talking about goals now, Chapman, you had her playing defensively, offensively, she scored her first goal for the team, what can you say about her play today? Well look, we said the full box were going to be important, you know, when a team plays with a diamond they give you a lot of space out wide and Chapman really bought into that and that's great to see, that's the modern fullback and that's what we need from her and we need more of that from our fullbacks in the international game so really proud because she puts a great shift in defensively and to get on the end and, and it was a wonderful finish as well, what a cracking finish so yeah she, she'll be happy tonight I'm sure. John, um, I started the game, you had a different lineup out there than you did the previous two games. Can you tell us why you'd gone the way you did today? Well, I think first thing, we wanted to freshen some people up because uh, we got a final, you know, and we, we always thought we only had to draw that game and, and also we wanted to keep some consistency in our part of our team but also give, um, you know, Adrian Leon, Janelle Foligno, they've been training very well. Uh, that opportunity to come in and start a game and get that experience because that's that's what this team's about. I mean, in Four Nations, we showed some real depth and we keep talking about the chemistry. It's important that we keep building those partnerships and relationships. Excellent. Now, last question for you. Um, you're going into the final of the Cypro, Cyprus Women's Cup 2015. How does that feel and how do you think this helps you prepare for the World Cup this summer? Well, it's important because it's just another big game and it gives us something absolutely to play for. So I think for our team now, it's tournament experience this is like a knockout game in a World Cup. We get drawn again with England, it looks like, who are, you know, one of the dark horses for the tournament. So it's, it's going to be a, a heck of a game. And I've just got to say that the girls have, you know, we planned this. We knew we were going to get to the final and we got there. And that's, that's a belief that's starting to, to build within this team. Excellent. Thanks, Coach. Good luck. Thank you.